Okay, this tip goes out to anyone who, like myself, has to actually look at the keyboard to type. The problem with this method is, one of them anyway, is that you can be typing right along and you look up at the screen and you discover that about a paragraph and a, and a half ago, you unknowingly accidentally hit the caps lock key. So there you are, you've got a paragraph or two of all capitals. What would be really nice is if you could highlight that text, hit caps lock, and reduce it back to, um, you know, lowercase letters. But that doesn't work, so your only option is you have to retype it. To minimize this or to eliminate it, you can enable a very handy feature that Windows has all the way back to 98. I don't know if 95 had it. It's been a while. But uh, all the current versions of Windows has this. It's one of the accessibility uh, features. Uh, I'll show you how to get to it right now. We're going to enable this. And what it does is it will make an audible beep. It will give a little tone to let you know that you have hit the caps lock key, whether intentionally or accidentally. Then this gives you a little heads up, and when you hear it, you can stop. Maybe you only type a couple of letters rather than a couple of paragraphs. So I have found this to be extremely helpful because, like I said, I have to watch as I type. So I'm using Windows XP Home. But uh, regardless of your version of Windows, this is very similar in all of them. We're going to hit the Start. Come up here and open the Control Panel. We're going to go to Accessibility Options here. Click that once. Now we're going to click this Accessibility Options again. Okay, now make sure that you're in the Keyboard tab. You've got these other tabs here, but we're going to go for the Keyboard tab down to right here where it says Toggle Keys. You place a check mark right here. We're going to apply that. We're going to say OK. We're going to come up here and close this window. Now I'm going to start tapping my caps lock key and you see if you can hear the noise that it makes. Can you hear that tone? This tip has saved me countless times. I've, I've found this to be an extremely useful tip. I hope that you benefit from it as well. If you have any comments or questions about this tip or anything else, Feel free to get a hold of me. You can email me at tj at tjstechtips.com.